Hello, uh, this is Tony, and today is Monday, the 28th of December. I wanted to uh, talk about this, um, a little bit more about this uh, bill being passed. Um, what, what Donald Trump is trying to accomplish here is they've got this new, uh, this, this act, it just got passed, it's called the, uh, I'm just looking for it here. Yeah, it's called the Empowerment Control Act of 1974. Uh, what that does is it basically allows him, rather than uh, vetoing this new Rona bill, he's allowed to send it back uh, to them with uh, the changes that he wants to be made. So uh, today, uh, Congress will be voting today on the $2,000 checks and probably some other items as well. Uh, these are the items that Trump is trying to change. So uh, primarily the $2,000 checks uh, for the, uh, the citizens rather than 600 Keep in mind, our tax dollars are paying for it for 900 billion. You think we should get more than 600? After all, we're paying for the whole damn thing. That being said, uh, also removing the waste from the bill—that's one of the items that Trump's sending back. And he also, most importantly, is 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 the requirement is to repeal the 230 Protections Act. What that is about is right now Facebook is being sued uh, on antitrust lawsuits right now several times, and even multi attorney generals are now involved in that. And, Google is going to be following behind that because censorship has just become too much. These companies have become too big, and they're just trying to shut down free speech. So uh, the 230 protections is important because, you know, here these their, their argument is always, well, you know, hey, we're just don't shoot the messenger. We're just posting this stuff. We don't have control over this. Yeah, but when you're starting to censor uh, videos, when you're shutting people down, and you're dictating and determining what people hear and what they don't hear, I'm sorry. There should be consequences to an action like that, and that's the 230 protection that, that needs to be removed, and then they would have consequences and they could be sued. I'm not a proponent of suing people, but in this particular case with these big money people, the only thing they understand is when you hit them in the pocketbook. So that would that would uh, leave open the, um, the freedom to be able to then sue them when you're censured for the damages that they've caused you. And I think that kind of thing, once that's gone, will start cleaning their act. They'll have to clean their act up or it's going to cost them a lot of money. So that's that's kind of what we're trying to accomplish here in the in the bill and what Trump's doing. But but by signing a bill, Trump is saying that he's restoring unemployment benefits. Yeah, that's a good thing. Stopping evictions. Now, I'm a landlord over 30 years, but I think that's a good thing because if a tenant can't pay his rent, it's not his fault right now. They're they're strangled, they're, they're shutting down business and they're they're just killing um, small business and, and because they want you dependent on them. The government wants to make you dependent so that they can control you. That's what this is all about. I'll go into another details about that at another time, but right now that suffices to say that. So I support the stopping the evictions, uh, also providing rental assistance, which not only would help the tenants, but that would also help landlords like myself. So all around, everybody wins. That's what you're trying to accomplish here. Add money for the PPP. Uh, return our airline workers back to work and adds add a lot more money uh, for vaccine distribution and much more now uh, I will be shooting another video uh, later this week regarding um, a small company which I believe has a better vaccine out there than this Pfizer and Moderna and all these people that have been talking about oh it's so great uh, I'll get into detail about that with this new video I'll be shooting it later in the week all that being said, I want to thank you for uh, listening to my rant. And um, oh, I wanted to, one more thing I left out in the last video. Uh, if, if you think that uh, Congress cares about you, know, well, here's the definition of a politician. Uh, it says here, a person who is professionally involved in politics, especially as a holder of or a candidate for an elected office. Oh, but wait, there's more below that. What's this say? Hmm. A person who acts in a manipulative and devious way, typically could gain advancement within an organization. So they're acting in a devious way and they're manipulating to simply gain advancements in their organization. Once again, they don't care about you. They only care about themselves. The 130000 for all the members that got it, uh, their checks, for not only nine months of work, prove it. The fact that they're trying to pass the, co the, the Rona bill uh, at the end of the year because the government shuts down the 31st of December. All red flags, folks. You got to learn how to think. That's what this channel's about. 
waking you up, getting you out of think, educating you, teaching you stuff, getting you equipped with the tools and the skills to approach life more successfully and, and even financially rewarding. So I want to thank you for taking the time. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification button for more videos to come. Thank you all, and you have a great day.